Hi guys, welcome to this tutorial. So in this session, we're going to solve question eight from the KCSE Mathematics uh, Paper 2 2021. I've had a request to do this question and because it's a short question, I'm going to do it right now. All right, so you can see it is a log question. What we have here is half a log nine base two plus uh, all this equal to seven. So what we want to do first is bring this half over here to the nine. So that's what I'm going to do. We have log uh, nine to the power half and base two, and then plus um, log of all this to base 2, 5x minus 4 equal to 7. So obviously now we can see, uh, first of all, this 9 to the power half, what does it mean? Right? It's just the square root of 9. So 9 to the power half is the same as square root of 9, which is 3, guys. Okay, so we're going to write this as log base 2, log 3 to base 2, plus log of all this again, so 5x minus 4 equals to 7. Now they are um, added together, what can we do? Well, we can use a product rule to put them together. And that's what I'm going to do. So we're going to do log of 3 base 2 guys times this lot. So we're going to multiply that. 5x minus 4, don't forget the bracket, so I'm going to put the other brackets as well, equal to 7. Alright, what can we do now? Well, we're going to raise this base to the power of 7, and that's going to be equal to 3, and then multiply by all this 5x minus 4, guys. Okay, so I've just removed the log. And now what you have, 2 to the power 7 is 128. And that's going to give you, we're going to expand this. So 3 times 5x is 15x. And then 3 times negative 4 is negative 12. We're going to add 12 on both sides in order to get rid of this 12 here, negative 12, which means now we're going to have 15x is equal to 128 plus 12 is 140. So therefore we can now say x is equal to 140 divided by 15. If you simplify this, you will get 28 over 3. All right, guys, so if you are going to round this to a decimal number and then check it on this uh, formula, it may not uh, be exactly the same. So if you want to check your answer, you have to put X as fraction and that will give you exactly 7. All right, I hope you enjoyed this session. Please remember to like, make some comment, guys, and also share. Bye for now.